So we got to Afrikiko, which has been recommended to, and uh, there's no parking, so we have to park outside here and then walk inside. Literally, no parking. Sitting waiting to pay the waiting to pay the waiter and the hundred cities has fallen into the water. Look. That's the money that has fallen. Hopefully he can. But how does it just go? Get it, get it. You have to do the water like what? It's going. Let me push it from here. Are you sure? Should I push it from here? Can you give me that stick? Alright, so now trying to hunt for a place to sleep so we tried after Kiko it's full because yeah everybody and their mother goes to any new new spot that is available we tried this other place called a low something it's right on the same Afrikiko stretch it's beautiful it's like very intimate also full we are the third place and guess what the reception is closed and they are telling us that the person who's supposed to be at the reception has gone to town so we have to wait has a cool vibe but Elo wins for me bro the rooms here are also full this is unbelievable see people are so tired of our car that slightest chance we get we are leaving Basically, all the resorts are full. What? The following footage is nightlife in Akusumbu.
can see flashlights. So this is my view. About to have some abodo. So abodo is one of my favorite things. Every time my dad used to travel forward to like the hotel region, the Kusumbo area, I would stay up all night <laughs> to wait for him to come back home with abodo. So this is what abodo looks like. We have that um, with this dish that we call one man pound. This is basically a really tiny dish. Hi, hello and happy new week. Whew. The week, um, this past weekend was a holiday, so you would think that I got enough rest, but I didn't. So today is Tuesday, back to work, and I am so tired. Like, I literally couldn't wait to close and come home. So today I came home a lot earlier. I think I got home like 30 minutes ago. So like that's around like 6 o'clock ish i still do have a lot of things to do so i can't even technically rest as much as i would like to but that's that i got some workout gear i don't know if it's just me but recently i've had this really strong urge or desire to just switch up everything so that's like switch up my wardrobe switch out the way i dress i feel like this blessing that is you know that i'm becoming you know it's like on a different level so my clothes and everything are just not it for me anymore anyway I decided to start with workout gear because that is something that I wear all the time I'm still trying to build my wardrobe properly so I'll probably talk about it when it's done or maybe mention what I'm getting as and when I'm getting it so this is my bag full of um, workout gear I would do a try on haul but I am too tired at this point, too tired, too exhausted. That probably will not happen, you see as I wear them in my videos. But I got workout bras, I got um, the leggings, I tried to get a little bit like colour because my workout gear is almost always black. and sometimes if i take a video or if i walk into the gym it's like why are you constantly wearing the same clothes so you know blue black this is green one this is uh one what else yeah and then more brass i also managed to get a swimsuit so when i was walking back from getting my um my workout stuff i saw a blazer and i was like hmm, i like this vintage blazer i really like gold details i don't like silver i don't think silver looks good on me so i always buy blazers that have gold buttons i like the plaid and it's it's almost new i think it actually is new it was really nice to get this if you watch my last vlog my last weekly vlog you remember that I mentioned that I got some hair bundles but I didn't have a closure to you know make them into a wig. I went to get a matching closure. It still doesn't match it properly. I just really needed to get this closure and just get the wig done. I just want a curly hair and I want it like right now. <laughs> the rest of the evening I'm going to make these into a wig. Fun fact, um, when I was in uni one of my side hustles was um, braiding hair getting crochet done for people selling wigs and stuff like that i eventually stopped because i had to start my national service and there was not enough time to do all those things and i was also um it was like a mobile salon so i'd come to your house and i'll do all for you hopefully i still have it in me good morning so last night i was able to finish my wig i've not been able to cut off the closure and tweeze the front and it is currently um 6 10 so i have to get out of the house right now and get to work i don't want to be stuck in traffic and to be able to get to work early complete editing today's video so that it can go up today i'm trying to be consistent on youtube hopefully i did a good job with this wig so yeah that's the update on the wig i would see you later all right so i managed to get to work earlier than i usually will so that i'll be able to put in some hours into editing my video that is going up today so this is what the wig looks like i don't like it i don't 
so I made a mistake right? usually if you sew a wig like normally how everybody will sew it it comes out this way and since it's a curly um, it's a curly wig I don't like the whole this way effect I want the, the, the volume to be at the back of my head so I have to take off the wefts that I sew in and make it this way so that it goes back yeah so that is why I've put it in a ponytail I would make the change God willing tonight and then I would wear it like you know down and everything the ends are also thin so I'm definitely going to cut it and give it like the whole illusion of a blunt wig ish Like this makeup is a bit different I also feel like I'm definitely going to wipe off this lip because it's too dark actually I'm gonna do that now I'm not sure why I thought a dark lip was a good idea anyway um, I go back from work late but I have to film a video because a video has to go up on Friday I have everything planned I wrote down a script when I was at work and everything so everything is ready I just have to sit down and get to filming and then edit it tonight and maybe a little bit tomorrow morning so that it can go up on Friday so I need to wear a tank top but I don't know I think I'll just wear a blazer which is so weird why am I wearing a blazer in a YouTube video and I will see you after I'm done filming my video or I'll see you tomorrow Right, so as a wrap I am done filming my video I'm so happy it took less than an hour to film which is growth which is so much growth like in the past one video would take so long to film because I'm I would usually be jittery or I would um, mess up my lines or I was not like fully prepared oh now I'm going to just take off my makeup and go work out I've decided to do a workout challenge with my friend so i'll let you know how that goes so it's another early start at the office i came in a lot earlier than everybody i'm still alone at the moment and yeah i have to edit before everybody comes in my glasses also finally came i liked it when i was picking out the frame but now i don't entirely like how it looks i don't know if it's all in my head but i don't i don't know i don't know Anyways, I have my glasses now. I think I'm done with adult bills for some time. So I'm just going to edit this video that's supposed to go up today. I'll probably see you. I think I'll vlog tomorrow. I'll go to the gym in the morning. So probably I'll vlog that. Otherwise, I'll see you soon.